You're listening to the Ask Drone You podcast. You ask, we answer your drone questions. Whether you're here to turn your passion into profit or you simply fly for fun, we're a community of learners and teachers who aspire to achieve greatness. We are Drone You. Hey everyone, welcome to another awesome episode of Ask Drone You. My name is Paul. And my name is Rob, and this is episode 499. Thanks guys for hanging out and getting us to this point. We really, really appreciate it. We definitely do. 499 means that we are one episode away from giving away another annual membership, which with all the things that we're doing right now, it seems pretty valuable. I think it's really valuable. Definitely. Besides just the actual cost of getting into the membership, which is very reasonable, to get in there and to be a part of that community and to get all the resources and all the new resources that are coming out and to be part of the Freedom Journal process. Oh my gosh. You want to win that thing. It's probably, yeah. Do you like giving those away, Rob? I love, I would, I would like to give more of them away. How does it make you feel? <laughs> it makes <laughs> me feel really good. <laughs> Maybe if you had a question in the last 50 episodes, you'll be up to win. We'll just see about that. We'll see if it works out. But we might as well get into today's show, which is sponsored by two people, DroneUbook.com. That's our book, Living the Drone Life, which will help you escape mediocrity and enjoy the world as it should be enjoyed, doing what you love if you love to fly. The second one is videoblocks.com, which kind of works flawlessly with what we do as drone pilots, creating videos and media. And if you're a lot like me, where you're trying to create more than just drone videos, there are videos that include drone, but also some groundwork, some slow-mo, some this, some that, you're going to love videoblocks.com forward slash drone. Why? Because you will have seven days of free access, unlimited access to get whatever you need for your next production, whether that's copyright-free video, some B-roll, some segues, transitions, or whether it's copyright-free audio. Maybe you need a sound wave. Maybe you need a door opening up and then slamming for a dramatic effect. Whatever yeah. it is, you can get it at videoblocks.com forward slash drone. Check them out. And keep in mind, that is a couple hundred dollars a year that you're getting for free for seven days. That is true. So couple check it out. hundo. That's, yeah, it's not a small chump change. It is not small chump change. Cool. Let's listen to the question. Bloody hell. I've been working so hard on getting the buttery smooth shots with my drone. I've got a lot of footage and I want to put it on video blocks. And as I'm getting ready to do it, I realize maybe I need a 107 in order to sell it. Uh, let me know if you guys can answer that question. And uh, I really, really appreciate you guys. And uh, that's the best accent I got, you guys. <laughs> really appreciate all you guys do. You guys rock. Uh, thank you so much. And uh, talk to you soon. All right. So... Great question and even better effort at the accent. Love that. Email me at uh, support at the drone you and we'll get you something out nice for trying that. And definitely. Uh, I've got to say, was, Robert, was it was quite good. It was very good. <laughs> I don't know what that was. <laughs> <laughs> See, here's the thing, guys. When you're doing the accents, you don't necessarily have to try to copy an existing accent. Make up your own. Yeah. Right? That might even be more fun. Yeah. And, and I buy... I no choice of mine. That's what I end up it doing. It just has to be <laughs> somewhat understandable. Well, certainly understandable, as in you can make out what they're saying. We oui, we oui, yes uh, yes you can talk like this and uh, <laughs> you can ask the question. That's good. That That's was my good. that was my French. Winter that was your Italian. Accent. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Um, but I have to say two things really quick. This guy has massive cojones for asking this question. Seriously. Cool. Why do you say that? Because a lot of people don't have the balls to come on a show and say, do I really need a license just to shoot stock footage? Yeah. In fact, I've noticed this attitude where people are like, I don't need a drone license if I'm just taking pictures and posting them on my business profile page. And they're just like showing you what I did. For example, there's a guy in town who runs a solar company. You know who I'm talking about because we're implementing that solar thing here at uh, the mortgage company. Mm -hmm. Um, and that being said, I've told him, I'm like, you can't post pictures on Facebook of the jobs you guys have done unless you have a license. And I've been nice about it. And I've been like, look, the whole idea, the reason that I'm a stickler about this is just because I want you to be educated. Right. So if there's an emergency or something happens, you, you know how to handle it. 
Um, and he's like, yeah, that's fair, you know. So I'm hooking him up, and he's going to become a Drone U member, and he's getting his license. Cool. But I really don't like the guys who go out of their way to say that because they're charging for something else. Like, you know, back in the day, that argument worked. But now that there's law, that it doesn't work anymore. Um, they say that I, I'm charging for something else. I'm not charging for Drone, thus it's not commercial. It specifically says in the law, mm -hmm. if you utilize any media out of the drone for a commercial purpose, for trade or exchange for value or services, you need a commercial license to do it. Yeah, and you can argue that point or, or maybe not even argue it, but be upset about it, but it doesn't change it. It doesn't change it. Yeah, yeah. you can act like a little whiner and say that 150 <laughs> bucks is a lot of money to get a license. Cry me a river. In, and honestly, let's see how many people care about it. So I don't mean to rain on your parades. The guys out there that listen to the show that have refused to get licenses, that's that's fine. That's your doing. Merry Christmas. Um, but stop. Yeah, you're really kind of hurting the whole industry. And people don't understand that. And as soon as I explain it to them, I say, look, you not having a license and you setting an example for your friends is going to ripple out. and It's going to have an effect. It may not be very big, but it will have an effect. Um, and if you like to fly, do you like to fly? Well, yeah. Yeah, because you have to keep in mind, I'm sorry, but this is about the end. It's a, it's a bigger picture perspective. It's bigger than yourself, so don't right. be a selfish little bee. <laughs> I love the way that we often say the same things, and but in quite different ways. Yes. <laughs> it's kind of fun. Hard knock life. Rob life. The bald life. <laughs> the bald life. That should be your next book, Rob, The, the bald, bald life. life. There we go. Yes. All right. That's there be are benefits to people. the bald life, by the way. In the morning, you know, for me, I got to brush my teeth, do my hair, all that. He doesn't have the time. I don't even he brush has my no teeth. Hair. Oh, Wait a minute. Okay. No, <laughs> <laughs> kidding. Oh, totally man. Kidding. Oh, man. But no, no, no. If you are shooting for stock footage, if you are shooting to promote your business, mm -hmm. advance your or business. Or promote somebody else's business. Correct. Right. Or you're doing it to trade and you do not have a license, you are liable for $1,100 fine to the federal government for every single piece of media and rule that you broke. So hold on. Let me put this in perspective. Okay. Okay. Let me put this in perspective. Please. We have a realtor. We have, well, let's, let's call, we need a name for this realtor. Let's, let's just, let's just personalize the worst of the worst. This realtor is the disorganized ADD, very difficult to work with doesn't understand media, drone licensing, and says, why do I need to hire a drone license operator when I can get someone for 25 bucks an hour who just bought a family from Best Buy? This is the type of person. Yeah. Do you have a name for them? Uh, Jack. Dana. I'm going to go with Dana. <laughs> Thanks for asking. Okay. <laughs> okay. Jack and Dana. Okay. Right. Jack and Dana are a <laughs> pair. Of, they're a real estate team. They're a real estate team. And Jack and Dana decide that they want to fly a house that's within class Delta airspace, okay? It's within Delta, and they're like, you know, I got I to gotta do this, like blah, blah, blah. They hire someone who has no drone license, and they get 25 pictures. And it took two batteries, okay, to get those 25 piece, pictures, yeah. okay? So now we're at 25 times 1,100 times two because they were in the airspace. So now it's 2,200 per photo. I hope you have your calculator really? handy. Uh-huh, Yes. Okay, so they didn't have a license. They were in restricted airspace. Then they used two batteries, right? That's another $1,100 right there. So you see how this is tallying up really fast? Yeah, it grows quick. Now, let me ask you a question. For everyone out there who hires an illegal drone pilot or a, a drone pilot without a license, would you like the federal government knocking on your door with a federal subpoena to shut down your business for a day? just to get all the information they need. It may, it may not even be a day. I've now seen this happen to someone. They shut down their office for a week, froze their bank accounts, and subpoenaed all the information for they real. need. For real. For real. Dang, that's messed up. So do you want that to happen to your business? In fact, there is someone, a realtor in town, that I want to say that to right now. And just be like, oh, they're in every town. Oh yeah, multiple of them. I actually want to tell. I actually want to go up to them and be like, do you enjoy making other lives hell? Do you realize karma is a? <laughs> <laughs> well, and here's the thing. It does and come back to you. All due respect to everybody who has gotten the 107. It is doable. It's. I mean, it takes some work. It's really there's not that hard, though. Well, but there's some study involved, depending particularly on your background and how familiar you are with the concepts 150 bucks some studying you go take it and you get the test you get it done just do it 
Just do it. Just like we're Nike stealing says. that tagline. Yes. Probably get sued for that. Probably not. Okay. Anyway. Just do it then. All right, guys. So whether it's trade, stock footage, or you are providing value to a business, advancing a business, providing exposure to a business, doing it for trade, you need a 107 license. It's seriously $150 and like a week of your time. Think about that. Maybe two. Versus 50K in fines. That would suck, huh? Yeah, that would suck. Plus, you're kind of looking over your shoulder. Who likes to live that way? Who likes to be paranoid? Yeah. I don't Uh, know. Maybe you're one of those that doesn't really give a crap, and so you don't look over your shoulder. But um, I think most people that are doing it without the 107, they probably are kind of looking over their shoulder a little bit. I would say there's one thing I've learned in my adult life, which I account adult life after college, and that is (laughs) whatever you do, it everything you do has an equal and opposite reaction. If you do things to hurt people or harm people, it will come back to you. If you do things right way, the nice That'll things will happen to well. you. Yeah. I mean, seriously, there are things that have happened five years ago and then like three weeks ago, you see the repercussion of it. Yeah. And you're just like, oh, you just think about it and you're like, well, what if I didn't do that? Do bad things happen to good people? Sure. Of course. You know, but at the same yeah. time, you really do and, get back what you put out. And good things happen to bad people. But what you're saying is it kind of often comes back around it always goes full circle yeah so anyway on the full circle bombshell that's gonna do it for us today my name is paul my name is rob this is ask drone you